Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In this video, I'm gonna be ranking aquatic turtles from S tier to F tier. So I figured this would be pretty useful for some of you guys who wanna know what is the best aquatic turtle to get based on maintenance, color, rating, and overall personality. So without any further ado, let's move on with the video. There will not be any shout outs for this video since it is a short video and I hope you guys enjoy. So right here is our S to F tier list and here are all the turtles right here in the bottom right. So now we're gonna start listing these out. First up, we have the snapping turtle. They're really cool turtles, but they like to bite a lot. So I'm gonna rank it probably in the D tier because I don't wanna be bitten by one of those snapping turtles because it hurts and I get bit by one of them in a river. So I don't think those are really good pets to keep. So next up right here, we have a map turtle and I have personal experience of keeping one of these before. And they're pretty cool pets, but they're not really cool as in Diamondback Terrapin, which I have now. So I'd say this is a C tier. Next up, we have a musk turtle. Now I don't have any personal experience with these, but I know that they're really small and they're low maintenance. So I'd rank this around a B. The coloring is not that really good. This is the reason it's not an A tier. All right, so after that, we have a painted turtle. I love these turtles. I've personally kept a painted turtle before and they're really cool pets. And I'd say this is around a B tier as well. The males are really kind of skittish and they don't really interact with you. And their personality is kind of bad, but their coloration is really, really gorgeous. All right, so next up we have the Diamondback Terrapin. And of course, this is my favorite turtle. I love their coloration. I love their personalities. I love the way they're interactive all the time. So I'd say this is an A tier. This is a really good turtle. I really love these, but the only issue is their maintenance. So I wouldn't say anything about an S tier. All right, so next we have a, the most popular pet turtle in the world, which is the Red Ear Slider. These turtles are seen almost in every pet store. These turtles are very, very bad in maintenance. They're invasive in Florida, actually, which is where I used to live. They're invasive and you cannot release them in the wild because they will start competing with the yellow belly sliders and create hybrids, and we don't want that in Florida. So this red ear slider, I'm gonna rate it at E tier because they're so bad on maintenance and they're not interactive and they can get really, really big. All right, so last but not least, the turtle I have most experience with is the yellow belly slider. I love these turtles. They're pretty good on maintenance, but they're still dirty and their coloration is really good. Their personalities are awesome. I'd say this is, goes with an A tier as well. I feel like they're really underrated compared to the red ear slider and this is sister of the red ear slider. So these turtles are a lot better than red ear sliders and I totally recommend them as your first turtle. So that'll be it for the video. If you did enjoy, make sure to like, subscribe. This is a different kind of video. Make sure to let me know if you like it in the comments and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.